All right, the next section looks at working concentrations out when we're given Kc. So, let's put some paper over here. Let's think of some really interesting letters. A and B. Okay, so A is in equilibrium with B. I'm, I'm not really concerned about what it is. Or all I know is I've got one molecule on this side and one molecule on that side. They're both liquids. Now, these two things are liquid. What we know is we start off with one mole of air. And the question says, if one mole of air is allowed to reach equilibrium, well, how many moles of B will be formed? And let's say Kc has a value of oh, 0 0.02. It will go on and add on things like at the temperature, the da-da-da-da-da-da-da. But really not interested. All I know is that I have one mole of A, my Kc is 0 0.02, and I need to work out the concentration of B. What not to do. Okay, now we can start with Kc. We we'll write this question for Kc is equal to the concentration of B, our products on the top, over the concentration of A, our reactants underneath. What we don't do is put a 1 underneath here and think 0 0.02 Therefore, 0 0.02 moles of B are made. And z no. We've got to do a little bit of algebra. If you don't like algebra, well, oh, hard luck. There's no way, real way around it. Okay. So let me explain to you what goes on in my bizarre, strange head of chemistry. Actually, just my bizarre, strange head. Okay. Not just chemistry. Life, the universe, and everything. The way I see it is, if I've got one mole of air... At the end of it, well I know, I'm going to end up with, let's say, x mole. I'm going to use x because we always use x in GCSE maths and for all those people who are not doing A-level maths, it's nice to be nostalgic and go back to GCSE maths. We have x moles of B. Well, if that's the case, at the point of equilibrium, if I've got x moles of B, I've actually lost x moles of A. The moles of A, that turned into B. I want to clarify it. Let's think of it another way. I must lose one molecule of A to make one molecule of B. That is really it. Okay, now let's do some funny algebra. I take my Kc expression. Kc equals the concentration of B over the concentration of A. And I substitute this time for my terms. Kc is equal to concentration of B, which is X, over concentration of A at the point when equilibrium was achieved, 1 minus x. Well, we know what Kc is. Kc is 0 point, right over here, 0 0.02. Given to us in the question, 1 minus x. Now here comes a lovely, lovely algebraic bit. So make some more room, some more papers so I can see what I'm going to do. This is divided by 1 minus x. There's two ways of looking at this. The float and ping method, which is taught in GCSE maths, which is, this is a divide, you take it across there, it becomes a times, to give us 0 0.02, and I put it in brackets, times 1 minus x equals x. And x is what we're trying to find. The other way of looking at it is, if I'm dividing this side by 1 minus x, I can multiply the side by 1 minus x to get rid of it, then I must multiply that side by 1 minus x. Whichever way you were taught is fine. There's probably another whole host of methodologies. Now if I expand this bracket, I end up with 1 times 0 0.02, which is 0 0.02, minus 0.02x, and that's all equal to x. Oh, now it gets strange. I've got an x on this side, an x on that side, and I don't like it. This is a minus x, so I must move it across here. Again, depending on how you think, the float and ping, the minus moves across, therefore it becomes a plus. Um, algebra, to mean to balance, either add 0.02x on this side to get rid of it, I must add 0.02x to that side. 0.02 equals x. Add 0.02x. For all those who do, you'll have mass. We'll now be going absolutely spare and insane. Saying, hurry up. Well, bear with me. 
1x, and that's all we have there, add 0 0.02, is 1.02x. Well, at this point here, I want x. I want x all by itself. So I divide this by 1.02. I divide this by 1.02. And what we should get is a concentration of B. So the concentration of B, and I'll put it in square brackets here, should be 0 0.01. One nine six moles. Excellent. That's done.